Police say a Middletown woman did not even care if her children were in the way. She wanted her estranged husband killed. That's right. Middletown police say that three people are charged now in a murder for hire plot that they learned about after the so-called hitman came forward. Nine on your side's Butler and Warren County reporter Jay Warren is live right now in Middletown with that story. Jay. A 42-year-old Shelly Carter is charged with three counts of conspiracy to commit aggravated murder. One, because of the alleged plot against her estranged husband. And then two more, because police say she didn't care for two young children were in harm's way. Police say Shelly Carter paid a man $500 up front and planned to pay him an additional $500 after the murder, plus a vehicle. Middletown police staked out her house on Brown Run Road last night, but got a tip that she was at the Madison Inn. That's where they found her, along with her boyfriend, Ryan Stark, who was arrested on an outstanding warrant. The whole thing has neighbor Ron Sturgis shocked. That, that's hard to believe. You hear that on a lot of stations or shows, but you don't see it in real life. Carly Berman with the city of Middletown explains how they found out about the plot. The subject that Ms. Carter hired actually came forward. The reason she has three counts um, against her is because her two children would have been involved and would have been in harm's way. Carter is owner of Dog Day's Grooming Salon in Middletown. It was locked up today when I went over there. Also charged in the alleged conspiracy are Casey Fryman and his wife Sarah, a couple who lives on Riverview Avenue in Middletown. They introduced Miss Carter to the subject. So they were the ones that basically set up the entire arrangement. As for Sturgis, he could only guess if the accusations are true, what would lead someone down that road. A lot of drugs going on and, you know, financial probably. I don't know. I mean, it's your second guess and everything that you're doing. So, yeah. And then you just got some sick people out there, too. So. Now, the man who came forward, he himself has not been charged. Police say he is working with them. The four others who were arrested, they'll stand before a judge tomorrow morning. Jay Warren, 9 on your side, Middletown.